Right over here, we have the 2023 Volvo C40 Recharge Pure Electric Ultimate. By far one of my favorite electric vehicles here on the lot. This comes at a price point of $29,977, which for an Ultimate, this is going to be the highest trim level on this vehicle. It's pretty insane. You're going to be getting the odometer reading, which is 4,669 miles. It is a pure electric vehicle, so you don't have to deal with gas. And as well as that, you get the Blackstone exterior paint coat with the charcoal leather interior, all wheel drive. And yeah, so if you have any other questions, definitely let us know about that. But something I want to let you all know as well is that since we're on a county island, you don't need to spend money on city sales tax. So you get to save around 2 to 3% when you purchase a vehicle from us compared to other dealerships around the area. Now, let's check this out a little bit more. MSRP is $60,100. Holy cow, you're saving like 30 grand. That is nuts. You get 226 miles of battery, 402 horsepower, and a four-year, 50,000-mile basic factory warranty. So if you have v friends in your vehicle and you want to go zero to 60, this is probably going to absolutely make everyone go wild. You're going to have that 360-degree view camera system, daytime running headlights, aluminum alloy wheels, foldable mirrors, keyless entry on the top. You're also going to be getting a panoramic moonroof. You got your little spoiler, Volvo C40 badges with a twin uh, recharge on the back. And we got our rear sensors. We got sensors all around the vehicle. So it's like a 360 degree view sensor type of ordeal. You're going to have your rubber lining, rubber floor mats looking really good. And also you have that cargo cover. Let's press that button, let that thing go down. And if we go on to the interior, we can check something out. So first off, you get that suede with the leather looking super good. As well as that, we can go on to the interior. You got heated seats for the back, USB-C ports that are going to be able to be plugged in right over here. Cup holders as well. And if we actually check that out, we got some rear ventilation. On the top, you get a true panoramic moonroof, meaning that you don't have a sunroof with this thing, which personally I think it looks really clean because you don't have that bar that's in the middle and it doesn't break as easy. You're also going to have your power adjustable seating for the driver and the passenger. And for the driver, you get two memory seat settings. You get the Harmony Card and stereo system, by far my favorite uh, stereo system that I know to this date. It's actually really nice. But you're also going to get a leather wrapped steering wheel. Gives you a little chime when you turn it on. You got adaptive cruise control, regular cruise control. You're going to have your buttons right over here to help you out. Navigation speed limit sign to the left. We actually open this thing up. We got our center console, little trash can right over here, cup holders, your wireless charging pad, little cigarette holder, two USB-C ports, 12 volt port, as well as that, you're gonna have your controls to the infotainment display right up here. Now, this thing is pretty loaded. So first off, we actually turn that on, you get heated seats for the driver and the passenger. You're also going to be getting um, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. And with that, you get Google, okay? Google Maps, I personally really like that because sometimes Apple likes to screw with you a little bit. You get the different driving modes, off-road and standard, you got the pilot assist, lane keeping aid, roadside information, and ready to drive notification, one pedal drive, and steering wheel feel firm. Now, let's click on this, 360 degree view. There you go, perfect. But if we go back, we can check out that rear view camera. If we go to the side, we can check out the side, making sure that you're not curb checking anything. You're also gonna have that, so those are profiles. But yeah, it's a really solid vehicle. I personally really enjoy it. You got the different type of things like air quality. I think that's a pretty cool thing as well, especially being near Phoenix where sometimes the air quality is not the best. But going up over here, you get three garage door openers, your rear view mirror. You're also gonna have your touch sensitive lights with the SOS button. And if we actually just look up, look at that. Pretty tinted, it's really nice. Let's actually feel it. Yeah, it's getting pretty hot outside. But if you have any other questions, definitely let us know. Again, this is by far one of my favorite vehicles that we have on the lot and we consistently have them. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.